welcome to another tutorials today we are going to learn how to locate information from a website and transfer such information into a word processing application so the first thing we are going to do is we are going to locate the information that we want within a website then the second thing that we do is we copy and paste the information found within the website into our word processing application then the last thing that we are going to perform is to save the copied and paste item in our word processing application on our computer desktop that is to store it on our hard drive for future use or for future references so we are going to learn how to locate information from a website and we are going to use two methods the first method is we are going to type the url which is the uniform resource locator or the website address of whatever web page that we want and the second method is to use a search engine to locate an information over the internet so to do this you have to make sure you have your internet connectivity so at the right bottom corner i have my internet access and i'm also going to use the opera mini browser to perform this particular operation so i'm going to open the opera mini on my tax bar now in the address bar i am going to search for my website address or my uniform resource locator now after typing the website address you hit the enter key on the keyboard now i have this web page based on the website address i have typed in the address bar and i have this search box to search for any information i want so i am going to click on the english and that is going to display this web page and i can walk through if i want any information here but i am going to search for my personal information so i'm going to click in this search box and search for any information that i want after typing my search i click on this search icon or go to page icon now this is going to display this information based on my search in this web page and i'm going to walk through this page so let me maximize this page now i have this file manager this gives me the definition of file manager it says a file manager or file browser is a computer program that provides a user interface to manage files and folders this helps you to have an accurate file management on your computer system so looking at this information it is very important to me and if i want to have this in my word processing application then the next option is to copy and paste this information into my word processing application now reading through this information they are very important so i'm going to select this information up to this line so what you do is you click at the beginning of this without releasing the mouse and drag to select the tests now that i have this test selected we have so many ways you can copy and paste this selected test in your word processing application what you can do is to right click and when you right click you have these options and you can see we have the copy command here you can left click or you can use your keyboard shortcut ctrl plus c on the keyboard to copy this item so now that we have this item copied in our clipboard what we do next is to open our word processing application and paste this item in the word processing application and i'm going to use the microsoft word software so we are going to minimize this browser click on the start button and search for microsoft word then you click to open
now we have our microsoft word application open and i want to paste this copied item from the internet which we have located so we are going to transfer this information into our word processing application to do this you can place your pointer in the area then you right click when you right click you have this paste option here and the first option is to paste this document by keeping the source formatting the second one is to merge formatting and the last one is to keep test only I'm going to choose the first option so this has pasted the copied item from the website or the web page into our word processing application so you can see that we have the definition for the file manager and also we have this links that is hyperlink and when you click on it this will also jump you back to the web browser to whatever web page that contains this information another way to paste an item is to move to the home tab and in the home tab we have this clipboard group and we have this paste option here and when you click on this paste command this is also going to paste the information in your word processing application when you click on a drop down arrow you have this option that we had when we right click on the document area so these are the procedure you can use to paste copied item from the internet i'm going to undo the second action so now we have this copied item in our word processing application using the website method so let's go back to our web browser now let's use the second method by using a search engine so let's open a new tab so we have learned how to use the website address or uniform resource locator to locate information using a site or website so we are going to use a search engine now i have this browser which is opera mini browser and it has its own search engine which is the google and i want to use the yahoo search engine to search for my information over the internet so in the address bar i am going to type the website address of the search engine then i hit the enter key on the keyboard this is the home page of yahoo and when you look at this area you can see we have this search box and you can see the cursor blinking in the search box meaning it is ready for any insertion so i'm going to click in this search box and type for any information that i want then i click on this search icon or go to page and this is going to navigate to the web service and pull out the information that i want we have some test here some are in hyperlink and some are also in the normal test when you come to this side i have this file explorer definition here that says file manager application that is included with releases of the microsoft windows operating system from windows 9.5 onwards now file explorer known as windows explorer is a file manager application that is included and this is a component in the operating system this helps you to manage your files now when i come to this area and navigate to get more hyperlinks and if i am satisfied with this hyperlink i can have a left mouse click on it And this is going to open another page based on the link and this gives you the procedure to open the file explorer on your windows so if i am satisfied with this information what i will do is the same procedure you can select using the mouse or to use the keyboard you can click to select a portion of the test then use your shift key and the arrow keys to select the remaining test so i am using the shift key and the arrow keys to select the test within this web page now if i am done with the selection i can right click and choose copy or i can use my control plus the c shortcut on the keyboard 
to select now that i have selected this test let me move back to my document area select a location then i can right click to choose this option or i can go back to this clipboard group and click on the paste command this time around i'm going to use the keyboard shortcut ctrl plus v on the keyboard and this is going to paste the copied item from the web page into our word processing application so this is how to locate information and transfer it into your word processing application now the last thing we are going to talk about in this tutorial is how to save this pasted item in word processing application and this is very simple to do you just move your mouse pointer to the top left corner and click on the file menu and we are going to have this backstage view and we are going to choose the save as command because this is a new document and when you click on it you get this interface and you are going to choose a location so i'm going to save it on my desktop click on desktop and i'm going to have this dialog box and i'm going to give a file name to this document and this is the first approach to save a new document because this is a new document you can use your keyboard shortcut ctrl plus s and this will also jump you to the backstage view then you can choose a location you get this dialog box and give a file name to this document the last method to save a new document is to use your functional key f12 on the keyboard this will bring out the save as dialog box and you can give a file name then you choose a location in the navigation pane then you click on save now on the title bar we have the name of the file that we gave to this document so now when i close this document i'm going to have my document on the desktop so the next time if i want to use this document i will just double click and now i'm going to have all this information in my word document so this is how to locate information within websites and also using the search engine then you also copy and paste this information that you've identified into your word processing application and save it for future references hope this video was helpful please give it a like comment and subscribe for more content and see you in the next video